for argument's sake, the Leafs lose Marner to an offer sheet. Do they immediately look at Line A or Kachuk and say, all right, we'll give those four draft picks right back? And it's they, a domino effect. They would have to. I mean, because, you know, to, to lose Mitch Marner, I think it's going to have to take something spectacular. Right. Like, a number, I mean, it's – it's not their intent. I mean, even if Mitch gets an offer sheet at ten and a half million, I think the Leafs ultimately match that. But right. if he gets eleven or twelve or thirteen, one of these numbers that's getting out there, and they do lose him, well, how else do you replace him? Because that's likely not happening on July first, right? Or certainly by the time the decision's made. So some of the guys like Artemi Panarin is, let's assume, he's already found his new home right. in free agency. I mean, who's available? Florida. Sorry. Go ahead. So the Leafs will have more cap space than they would have thought they had. Yeah. I think it would fully be something they would have to consider. And who could blame them in that case? I mean, why not? I mean, it's, it's, it's not happening. It's not man. happening. It's not. I've, we've gone down this but damn road every year. I'm, with here's the good guys. news. I'm just saying, if it does, finally, chickens, if it not does doing finally happen, Sixero, people better watch out because there will be a dog. Well, I'm with you, and I'm you rooting for it. You have to. I'm rooting for it, but I don't buy it. I don't buy it. No, Put it this way. It's not happening. It's not a coincidence they're all unsigned. I think they all want to be Correct. hanging around this dance just in case. Just in case something the, happens. The yeah. right uh, oh, suitor you, comes yeah. along. Oh, yeah, I, I think they're keeping their options open, so to speak. Yeah. But the martyr thing is more interesting to me the most because there's a respect word in the middle of that, too. For sure. It's not just money. He's looking around at the rest of the room. He's getting more local TV ads than anyone else in the market. Marner knows exactly his place. He's got the personality to handle it and the talent, and he's done it for two straight years. This is not strictly the money play. If he feels like that organization isn't going to respect him like Tavares and Matthews, let's cut to the chase, that guy's going to leave. No. Okay, now really? you're going a bit too far. Really? That's, so he's going to sit back as a leading goal scorer for two straight years. Yeah, no, he's a winner. That's a misnomer. He's not a, the, the other year, that, there was that's injuries. That's not a misnomer. It is. That's not a misnomer. And he wasn't a leading goal scorer. He was point getter. Point getter. Right. Forgive me. Well, there's a Who difference the in how you get paid, though. the most on the Leafs. I'm just saying respect towards his camp. The one thing we kind of heard from a lot of people, I've heard from you as well, that Tavares is wasn't pretty on the important team for Mitch two years Martin. ago, and Austin Matthews was hurt for a significant amount of time. And they moved heaven and earth to bring in Tavares. Yeah. And they gave Austin Matthews not even a full – they gave him the term he wanted, two at five. So he's looking at two guys who the Leafs have gone out of their way to take to care be of. Fair, he's thinking, why not me? Well, because I think they're – look, at they're taking care of him. I mean, how do we describe this? If he gets paid $10 million – Is that not taken care of? That's taken care of. If, well, $10 million would have taken care of it by now, wouldn't it? Part no. of the fun. Really? That's, I think that's why we're at this point, because $10 million isn't taking care of it yet. Okay. But – I, I mean, I, we have to be careful here. I because I just think he's. We know he's getting paid a ton of money at the end of this. That won't be an issue. Yeah. yeah. That won't and be an issue. I do think there's a scenario when it's done that it's not this inflammatory thing. But right, right now right. the gas is flowing. <laughs> Sid's got the matchbook. He's gone. <laughs> right. I'm just. Saying, Sid's not, not the only Listen, one with a matchbook. Right no, no, no. If I'm, I'm just, Mitch Marner, I'm not liking how this is playing out. I had eyes. I saw that thing played last year. Marner was in the damn video Hold they on. showed Tavares about winning a cup. But you could see if Miko Rantanen ends up with nine, and he's around that number, and all these other guys are at eight and seven and six, you can kind of point to them to not just the, the $11 million. But, you, but if there's another team offering 11. Sorry, Chris, you I'm trying to talk this down. No, if, no, but, but, but there's another team offering 11, you don't have to point to anything. Correct. Because then I got the leverage. Correct. And, I'm, and, and what we're all kind of agreeing with here is the atmosphere is at a certain point where we could see that. We could see that leverage kind of shift towards anyone, towards a Matthew Kachuk, towards a Lan Patrick Laine, towards whoever. And this could be a fun couple of weeks. Now, I think a sheet is anyway. unlikely. But the one thing I do wonder if one that could come along that the Leafs wouldn't like is a short-term deal at the, the number is something like 10.58. Yeah. And that's at the threshold where, where let's say he gets that on a three-year contract. Yeah. The, if the Leafs take the compensation, and it's two firsts, a second, and a third. I think reasonably they're not going to take that. Right. But that would be a contract they wouldn't want Mitch on on that short a deal because then he's getting another deal in three years. Yeah, yeah. So it's possible someone gives an offer sheet to poke at them. But we haven't seen that. I mean, there's not, no. a, there's not a culture of that in the sport, so we're only guessing. But right. The truth is it only takes one, and everybody's got their phone number right now.